was handing YouTube another wild situation. Let's get right into this. Now, today's video is going to be on the famous C Mac man, 5 5 Crip himself, the most famous Crip right now, C Mac from that 55th Street. You know, he got himself in a, in a sticky situation. A wild situation for sure, man. Because it's not a winning situation. It's for sure not a winning situation. It's a wild situation, man. His ex-manager, dude that got him under contract, is now saying that he's under contract for four and a half more years. Damn near five more years, pretty much he's saying that Crip Mac and everything, everything Crip Mac does in regards to content belongs to him he needs to his cut so crip mac's been doing content lately with odm slim china mac adam 22 the no jumper dudes and you know he's been getting his money up you know he just got out so he's stacking up his chicken mcnuggets this dude 600 said he's gonna take all of them to court if they don't pay him his money he got the nerve to call crip mac his little brother his little bro his homeboy all this and that, right? But say he need his cut. Four and a half years, he belongs to him still. That ain't no homeboy, bro. He did say a contract is a contract, and he needs his percentage. Like, damn, bro, he can't eat? Like, you know what I'm saying? He fresh home. You want a cut out of everything he do? So he's saying that he's going to take all these dudes to court, right? China Mac, uh, ODM Slim, No Jumper. Anybody that does practically any business with C-Mac and doesn't pay him, he's taking them to court. C-Mac needs to take this dude to court. You feel me? If he's willing to take all these dudes to court and get some, take money from, from C-Mac's pockets, then C-Mac need to get out of that contract. As we all know, C-Mac take hot meds. You know what I'm saying? He takes medication. I think he said in the past that he's schizophrenia. He has, you know, he, he has he has his condition, bro. All he has to do is go to court and say he wasn't in the right state of mind at the time of the contract. And, you know, the judge is going to rule in his favor every time. He just All you got to do is walk in there and just look norm, look, look how he regularly looks. And the judge going to be like, yeah, this motherfucker needs to be taking his meds. Ain't no way he he was he knew what he was signing. You feel me? Ain't no way he knew what he was signing. This motherfucker needs his meds. You know what I'm saying? So uh, let's throw this contract out. And yeah, man, that's all C Mac need to do. Take that nigga to court since he wanna dibble in all your money, man. Fuck that. Check out what this dude six hundred had to say. The uh. Fake Suge Knight. Nah. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. It's the kid and I'm gone. A PSA. Before we actually get to the business part of it. You know that. She make my dog. That's my boy. That's my little bro. That's my homie. That's everything. You know what I'm saying? That's going to remain like that. But, you know, business is business. And... I've been seeing, you know, he's been doing a lot of business with people. You know what I'm saying? Adam 22, you know, China Mac, ODM Slim, you know what I'm saying? And all these people know that he's under contract. You know what I'm saying? So they all really preparing themselves for a lawsuit. You know, I really just been busy letting C Mac do his thing, you know, get his money. And you know, keep running up a bill. But you know, when I settle down and stop doing what I'm doing, I'm gonna have a conversation with ODM Slim, Adam 22, and China Mac. Cause they all know he's under contract. You know, he got four and a half more years, you know what I'm saying?